Hi all, welcome back with another episode of the Book of Enoch from the Truth Seeker channel. And today I'll continue with the second parable, and chapter 46. And there I saw one who had a head of days, and his head was white like wool. And with him, with him there was another whose face had the appearance of a man, and his face was full of grace like one of the holy angels. And I asked one of the holy angels who went with me and showed me all the secrets about that son of man, who he was and from where he was, and why he went with the head of eight days. And he answered me and said to me, This is the son of man who has righteousness and with whom righteousness dwells. He will reveal all the treasures of that which is secret. For the Lord of spirits has chosen him, and through uprightness, his lot has surpassed all others in front of the Lord of Spirits forever. And this Son of Man, who you have seen, will arouse the kings and the powerful from their resting place, and the strong from their thrones, and will lose their reins of the strong, and will break the teeth of the sinners. And he will cast down the kings from their thrones and from their kingdoms, from they do not exalt him and do not praise him, and do not humbly acknowledge from where their kingdom was given to them. And he will cast down the faces of the strong, and shame will fill them, and darkness will be their dwelling, and worms will be their resting place, and they will have no hope of rising from their resting places, for they do not exalt the name of the Lord of Spirits. And these are they who judge the stars of heaven, and raise their hands against the Most High, and trample upon the dry ground, and dwell upon it, and all their deeds show iniquity, iniquity, and their power rests on their riches, and their fate is in their gods that they have made with their hands, and they deny the name of the Lord of Spirits, and they will be driven from the houses of his congregation, and of the faithful who depend on the name of the Lord of the spirits, Lord of spirits. Chapter 47 And in those days the prayer of the righteous and the blood of the righteous will have ascended from the earth in front of the Lord of spirits. In these days the holy ones who live in heaven above will unite with one voice and supplicate and pray and praise and give thanks and bless in the name of the Lord of spirits because of the blood of the righteous that has been poured out. And because of the prayer of the righteous, so that it may not cease in front of the Lord of Spirits, so that justice might be done to them, and that their patience may not have to last forever. And in those days I saw the head of days sit down on the throne of his glory, and the books of the living were opened in front of him, and all his host which dwell in the heavens above and his council were standing in front of him and the hearts of the holy ones were full of joy that the number of righteousness has had been reached and the prayer of the righteous had been heard and the blood of the righteous had not been required in front of the lord of spirits amen a lot of Lord of Spirits and the righteous and holy, holy, holy. And I think later on in the Bible they used these texts and made made it more normal, like for an average human to read it and not get scared. Or maybe the Old Testament was also a bit scary, but the New Testament they like made a more milder version of this god lord of spirits let me see chapter 48 is uh, very long i'll continue with that next time thank you for watching and subscribe to the channel